All right, Zach, thanks so much. Let's get right to your news headlines this morning. The window of opportunity starts today. Every Texan at least 16 years old or older is now eligible to receive a COVID-19 vaccine shot. Right now, more than 3.6 million Texans are fully vaccinated. More than 7 million have had at least one dose and 10 million doses have been administered so far. More than 21,000 doses are heading to Central Texas this week, so the demand is going to rise. Texas Today's Maria Aguilera has details if you haven't already signed up. Maria? Heidi and Chris, just because most Texans are now eligible to receive the vaccine doesn't mean that everyone can get one right away, but it is important to know where you can register and sign up for a wait list. The demand for the COVID-19 vaccine is high now that all Texans 16 and older are eligible to receive it. According to the state health department, as of late March, over 3 million Texans have been fully vaccinated, while over 6 million have received at least one dose. While now everyone could uh, be eligible to get a vaccine, that doesn't mean we suddenly have a vaccine for every person who wants one. James Stafford, a public information officer for Bell County, says the best source of information is the Public Health District's website. There you can find sign-up links through the hospitals they've partnered with. We are getting more and more doses each week now. Uh, the supply has increased, which is very positive. Um, and now it's just a matter of us finding the best ways we, we can to deliver those doses to people. Stafford says the demand is still outpacing their supply and ability to deliver the vaccines. So they partnered with a third party company to help administer more doses beginning mid-April. They're going to start operating sites um, across Bell County. And those are going to be large scale uh, drive through predominantly sites. In McLennan County, supply continues to be limited, so they've got a wait list sign up even for those in phase 1A and 1B. Both counties recommend staying up to date with your local health districts for vaccine availability and appointments. According to the state health department, providers will continue to prioritize those who are most at risk. Maria Aguilera, 6 News, back to you. All right, Maria, thanks so much. We want to make sure it's easy for you to sign up. Text vaccine to the number on your screen. We will send you a full list of numbers and websites to get you started. And if you haven't already, do you plan on getting vaccinated? Tell us why or why not by texting us at the number right now on your screen. 254-859-5481. We'll take a look at your thoughts all morning long.